Dear Medicos, we are having the honor to have Dr. Vijaya with us, All India Rank 320, a proud dams Vijaywada student. So, better we congrats you on this great form. After, Thank you, sir. Thank you. After, after getting this awesome achievement, better how you're feeling now? I'm feeling very happy, sir. Overwhelmed. So, like, Bida, I will be using this platform. Can you share your success journey with us? Like, you join us in Dams Vijayawada. So, how was the experience of those face-to-face -face lectures, Bida? Uh, sir, I am an undergraduate from Andhra Medical College, sir, in Andhra Pradesh. And uh, I had joined the pre-foundation classes in second year, sir, for Dams. But I could not attend the classes completely, sir. I was able to attend only few classes because of the uh, ward postings and all in the ward, regular postings and regular classes, sir. So after internship, I completely joined the face-to-face -face classes in Dam Sujayana, sir. Um, I attended all, all the classes only from Dam, sir. I did not go for any other source. I trusted Dams and I attend all the subjects only from Dam, sir. And... Uh, I felt that the greatest advantage of live to live classes was the interaction, sir, because we were able to get one on one with the uh, faculty and we were able to ask, uh, clear our doubts and we are able to um, uh, clear our concepts better in the class itself so that we will not have any doubts when you are revising the notes. Sir. And uh, during the classes, the main advantage was that in between the classes, we used to give tips, sir, like how to prepare the notes, how to read it and how to revise it. Those tips were very helpful, especially during the revision time, sir. And I felt that all the faculty were very great in motivating us and uh, pushing us to move further and uh, push our limits and work even more harder, sir. Because seeing you taking that much efforts and uh, telling us classes for 10 hours, 12 hours straight, we got motivated, sir, that, okay, we also have to do something more to get our rank. And, all. and uh, the way you guided was very good, sir. Uh, the guidance we got from each and every faculty was very, very great, sir. Especially you, Sumer, sir, and uh, Deepti ma'am. Deepti ma'am could not attend the live classes, sir. We got Amit, sir, for uh, gynecology live classes. Even Amit, sir, was great, sir. Every faculty was uh, great in their own aspects. And uh, I actually blindly tested them, sir. I did not go for any sources for any of the subjects or any of the videos or bits or whatever, sir. And... Uh, even uh, for the grand test and all the video solutions, I felt that they were very great, sir, because we were able to clear all our concepts and doubts and how to approach a question was best in the video solutions, sir. So, well, first of all, I will thank you. Okay, you are you followed dams religiously, like you are saying this statement again and again. Yeah, I just attended dams. I have faith on dams. And now you're getting rank 320. That is awesome achievement. What I feel, honestly, yes, what I feel, the students in top 500, that all are academically sound. The differences of the day, like one or two MCQs, you yes, couldn't, yes, that, that is the only difference. Otherwise, academically, you are at the same level as a rank one or rank two student. But I feel, and you're giving very honest feedback, yes. hey, we should focus on one source, then we should go with the multiple revision. Now, my question is, like, yes. you have very nicely you explained the role of classroom, like, apart from academics, all the faculties, they motivate you. What was the importance of self-written class notes, Vita? The notes you are writing in the class with the faculty. Yes, sir. Uh, I feel that when we are attending the live classes and writing the notes, we are getting multi-modality of input, sir, because we are listening, we are reading, and we are writing, sir. Uh, I used to hear that from my seniors and uh, even from the faculty that that multimodality teaching is able to help you. I was like, okay. But when I was again revising the notes and all, I felt that even though I have written the notes like two, three months before, but when, when I was opening the notes, I felt like, okay, it's my notes. I have written it. I had that inbuilt confidence that, okay, I will be able to do the revision, sir. That was the first input was confidence, sir, because it was something I have written that was... I understood it, I wrote it, and uh, I'll be right. If we are having any doubts, we'll be correcting it. We'll be writing in pencil and all all the explanations and all we'll be writing, no, sir, in the written notes, self-written notes. That was the advantage, sir, because it gave first inbuilt confidence that, okay, even the notes is looking this much, big, okay, I can do it because it was something I wrote it. That was the main advantage, sir. And... Uh, um, because we are right, making the notes as we are listening the class, I think that is more retaining, sir, as compared to pre-written notes. 
very true very true and but i like I, as a faculty i feel that okay, when you are writing with the faculty in the classroom in the live lecture whether you are even you are on my e medicos uh, live lecture you may have realized this difference okay, you are just shifting from a slow learner to a fast learner when you are writing at the speed of faculty somewhere you are coming out of your comfort and you are just becoming a fast learner what was your experience like in dams classes you felt this phenomena ke liya, i change a lot like attending all the 90 subjects some change in the learning ah uh, yes sir the speed of co covering of subjects was better in live classes sir because in pre recorded videos i tried some pre recorded videos sir i was unable to complete the syllabus and all but in live classes we'll be having that drive uh, uh, that if we are able to if you are missing some topic it's like it's missed again we have to see the video if it is available on the app to cover it that fear of missing the topic and missing the uh, subject or uh, that i will be having a doubt in that concept if i am missing it that fear was able to keep it attentive all throughout the class sir even though classes were like 10 hours to 12 hours so even the faculty were also not that much fast sir they were able to go in the tempo of the students so it was not too fast it was not too slow sir but it was covering the subjects in the ample time sir we were yeah. able to understand that okay this is the subject which requires only 3 days for yeah. listening the class only 3 days for reading that time was i able to get from live classes sir that time management in in the examination hall before the examination hall is mandatory but i feel like 19 subjects are yes. there so we should focus on the time management so i this is a very yes. a golden message very nice message you are sharing with the students that we have to attend all the classroom learning and this there is no substitute to the classroom learning because we are completing all the subjects on the given time framework absolutely true very true beta now coming on the next segment i am taking the mcq part like last need many students were saying yes. paper was a typical paper was little bit different so what was your experience of the last need exam what where you will rate the last need beta mild moderate or it was difficult paper uh it was moderate sir i would not say rather it is too easy or too difficult it was moderate sir but i felt that the distribution of questions was slightly unequal sir like uh, from same topic two to three questions got repeated sir it was it's not something we usually see every year no sir because every year we'll be having distribution of random topics will be present sir but here for example vernicke sense of lopathy alcoholism vitamin deficiencies we had like multiple questions from those topics sir Uh, that I felt that some unequal distribution was there, there sir. But important topics were only asked, sir. Most of the topics what you stress in class and uh, most of the PYQs were only repeated, sir. Important topics were only asked almost around around uh, up to one twenty to one thirty questions were uh, the standard stock questions, sir. What we feel that they'll be asked in the exam. The remaining questions, a few questions, I felt that uh, they were never asked, sir. For example, in ophthalmology, they gave a graph. Uh, they gave an image of lens asking for astigmatism i i exactly don't know the answer but some questions were out of the box sir but most of the questions were the standard typical questions what we actually expect sir and if you compare the level of mcqs like class test grand test our swt all tnd also all the mcqs you were exposed in this one year last one year with the times family what was the like if, yes, how you sir. compare those mcqs were difficult or they were on the lower side With the neat exam, neat MCQs. Uh, some questions were uh, like difficult, sir. But uh, remaining all other questions were on par with the neat uh, difficulty level, sir. And Because in the class test and all, you will be, you will be adding both neat and INI set questions, no, sir. So that INI set part of the questions were some somewhat like out of the box, sir. But most of the questions were on the standard with neat, sir. Like I like I'm we are proud to share Doctor Vijay with us rank three to zero and I feel most of the students who start their PG preparation they have a dream that I should get rank in the top five hundred every student even when we were preparing we have this dream that we our rank should be in top five hundred and now you have achieved that yes. dream branch ranking now you keep, uh, can you update like what should be the strategy like if I am the beginner I am starting my preparation for the next NEET examination which subject I should give more preference better like i am having 8 to 9 months for the pg preparation and now which subject should be given priority what do you feel um uh, i feel like rather than uh, uh scoring sub uh, we have to first focus on the scoring subjects sir like 
ENT, Ostal, SPM, and uh, uh, first year subjects, anatomy, physiology, and biochemistry, because we have less bulk to read and we are having more amount of questions which are coming from them, sir. Because from reading less amount of topic, when you're getting more amount of questions, that will be more easy, sir. Rather than uh, uh, spending one month like that for medicine and surgery, that would be not that much high yielding, sir. I right. felt that. Because yeah. uh, even after spending one month for medicine, we'll be getting only uh, around 20 questions correct out of 25 because remaining five will be based on application and all. Right. Whereas in these memory topics, like for example, SPM, SPM, it's lo it looks like it is a fearing subject, sir, but uh, our faculty made it very, very easy for revising the SPM and all, sir. Uh, and uh, these subjects, like for example, SPM and ENT, ophthalmology, biochemistry, these memory subjects, they are very high yielding, sir. I felt that. Very true. We and should... if we are able to. Yeah, we should focus on the short subjects first. Yes, sir. Because when we focus on medicine and surgery, when we start them sub uh, first, they will not be completing and they will be taking a lot of time. We will be in the panic of, we will be going into FOMO, sir. Absolutely. Very true, Veda. Now, Dr. Vijay, just coming in the last spell, when you attended our DVT session, how was the experience of yes. DVT days in your success journey of this rank 320? <laughs> DVT was like a... <laughs> smile on your face, the spelling a maximum MCQs were there from DVT, yeah? Yes, sir. How was the experience? Like, and... Uh... Almost 40 to 50 percent of the questions were directly or indirectly from the DVT, sir. Um, I mean, I don't say they were from the lines of DVT, but the topics which are covered in DVT. Uh, those, if we are able to revise in the notes again, they were very high yielding, sir. Uh, and in the last 10 days before the exam, I really had this uh, panic, sir. I was unable to decide on what to read. I did not complete the sufficient number of revisions before the exam, sir. I was able to complete one revision completely and uh, the other revision I completed major subjects. Sir. So I was like, uh, I did not complete sufficient number of revisions. What should I do? In the last 10 days, I focused more on DVT. Sir. I used to keep the DVT book on one side and the subject notes on the other side. And I used to take the topics of the DVT and read them from notes. Sir. That helped me a lot, sir. Ex especially in uh, subjects like biochemistry um, and... Uh, uh, major subjects are like, for example, medicine and surgery. Among the, all that bulk of what to read, when focusing on DVT topics, it was a very, I felt that, okay, these subjects are doable before the exam. Sir. That gave me a lot of confidence. And, and uh, as they always say, DVT is gold standard for the exam. Sir. 40 to 50 percent of questions were coming from the DVT, sir. either directly or indirectly from the topics we read. I will highlight this point. KDVT is a gold standard for neat PG preparation. Very, very, very true, very correct statement. Yeah. <laughs> now, Madam Vijay, like the last few days when you attended PYQ, how was the experience of PYQ? After attending PYQ, your confidence boosted? Yes, I will be able to crack all of the most important topics. Yes, yes sir. Uh, I actually did the PYQs during my first revision, sir. When I was completing the subject, I did the PYQs then, sir. I was like, okay, I did the PYQs. Then should I do again PYQ? Kabab? No, it is video based. It is taking time. But I felt like doing that was uh, one more. It, it gave a confidence that, okay, PYQs were doable questions. They're not asking some random unexpected questions or they're not asking something out of the box. Most of the questions, for example, if you're having 10 questions, around seven to eight questions are from the standard topics from what we have read. That confidence is coming from PYQs. And what was your experience? You just shared the moment when you saw that image of Force of Rosenmuller, that PYQ click in your mind, but when I am seeing your VNT. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So I, yes, sir. I can conclude. Even the. I can conclude from your words. Even the. DVT and PYQ was the final punch. They were the main important tool for revision in the last spell. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, you were saying something. In the last. Uh, even the images also, sir. Uh, I did one thing, sir, when the classes were going on, whatever images you used, to, any faculty used to show on the slides, I used to take pictures of them, sir. So whenever I was rewriting the notes, I used to write that, for example, if it is an image-based question, I used to write image on the topic, sir. So whenever I was reading the notes, I was able to revise the images also, sir, because they were in my phone. That helped me a lot in cracking image-based questions, sir. 
at the end when i came to the end most of my friends used to ask about the images sir like i we are unable to do image based questions correctly the topic is able to do over but unable to identify the images i felt that that was one of the a good thing i did during the classes sir because i was able to revise the image along with the notes so i was getting uh, whenever i was see the topic i was getting the image of the mind in my brain sir so i was able to identify image based questions better during the exam sir that was one of the advantage sir because all the faculty used to show standard live images and standard images in the classes sir so most of the images were related to that images when they are asking the questions and coming on better like any special message for dams family for all the faculties who help you in the last one year sir it's like a big vote of thanks sir i was expecting something around i mean i did not expect this rank sir nobody will expect that they will be getting 300 200 no sir we'll be expect after the exam we'll be expecting that okay i will be getting a rank which will be getting me a good seat but this rank was i was very very happy sir and uh, obviously it was not doable without all the faculty support and uh, the notes whatever gold standard notes you are giving sir you used to repeat in the class no sir that uh, short notes should be there and they have to be repeated multiple number of times very nice great and any special message for your family beta because of whom you achieved this thank to 320 um sir big word of thanks to them also sir because my father used to support me in every step of the life sir i'm the first medic of my family that's great so uh i have i mean there was nobody to guide what to take or what to do and all sir but family stood as a big rock of support sir and my now my sister is also medic sir okay. she is in uh, internship currently sir now you will be the big motivation for her and she will definitely she will cry very much but i i wish her very thank, best thank you sir you can we have to your parents your sister and this is a big achievement for your family buddy right thank now, you sir thank you so much sir i want i want a special message for andhra student like in your lang- in your local language <laughs> you can give a special message in your language for andhra students only <laughs> in telugu sir yeah sure <laughs> <laughs> um any special message for your college your students um manam emi takku kaadu mana confidence e manalni munduku teeskelthadi just blindly trust what you are doing and go forward that's it thanks beta thanks for your kind words and thanks for coming on this great form giving your giving very honest review of to all the medicos ki you have just you had a faith on dams and you attended all the lectures very religiously and what i'm getting from your success ki if we focus on one thing if we just don't waste our time here and there in the multiple sources what is the best way to get a good achievement clear okay. so thanks beta thanks for coming and we wish you very best of luck thank you sir thank you for your time sir thank, thank you for you. your kind words Thank and you. thanks to entire dams faculty for making this possible for me sir thank you so much sir thank you beta thank you